This is quite nice. Oh, I just stepped into some birch. Oh. It was August 23rd, 7am with 28 degrees, whilst the sun was orbiting the, uh, no wait, the earth was orbiting the sun at a whopping 67,000 miles per hour and Bitcoin falling at a rapid rate of 4.57%. Thanks Elon. With this, I got up and went to the mirror to say my daily affirmation. Ew. <laughs> because nothing better than a positive start to the day, am I right? Yes, yes I am right. Then to actually start off my day properly and well, I went outside to my balcony, or at least I tried. But my mosquito net was stuck and unfortunately I destroyed okay. it. Regardless, I just about made my way out. Then took a nice little look around all the peasants that I'm looking down upon that- wait, what? There better not be some massive spiders out here as well. <gasps> That wasp did just try to zap me. Don't even lie. What a great start to my day. I think I'm gonna stick to my window instead of balcony. Oh my god. What the actual hell do bees have against me? Why am I constantly being attacked? Came over to this window. Being highly fed up with a double wasp attack because one wasn't enough, I made my way to the shops and got some breakfast. Then I sat down on the dirty floor eating my definitely very healthy and nutritious breakfast. And yes, I do also eat it off the floor, off the dirty floor because me and jams, I just, I just don't really have much of a concept of it. Bruh. Okay, it is exactly 10 a.m. Um, finished my lovely nutritious breakfast and now we're off to the gym and we're gonna hit some arms because I realize they are too small. They're not actually, I'm insecure because they are too big but um, I realized they're not gonna get any smaller so we might as well just make them bigger and more defined because why not, why not? Stop being insecure. Also normally I work out at seven, no, no I don't, that's a lie. I work out normally it's 8, now it's 10, but you know, we're still gonna get it in regardless. Also guys, please do not shame me for what I'm about to show you. <sighs> I know it's gonna make me inferior and everyone's gonna bully me, but regardless, I do use lifting gloves. Um, but the only reason, not because I don't wanna get scabs, is because our weights are rusty and because my hands sweat. So at the end of the day, it would just make a pool in my hands of like rusty mud. So for that reason, I use lifting gloves and also look how cute they are. At the end of the day, I think you're just jealous because you don't have them and you're too insecure to use them. So hmm. be jealous, stay jealous and stay hating. So here's a random arm workout, not my usual for some of you people who are asking how I'd work out my arms because you wanna be like me, because you wanna have big arms, because I have big arms. Firstly, I just do some mobility exercises you know, to get warmed up and get prepared for actually lifting. Then today, I just randomly chose some exercises, starting with basic bicep curls. I did three sets of 10 as per usual, but instead of being a normal person and just doing bicep curls, I decided to do it as a tri set. A tri set is three exercises after each other. So I did some of these pull downs. I don't know what they're called, close grip. And then, because I'm insane, I also did some lap pull downs or whatever these are, back, I don't know. All of them, three sets of 10 in a circuit. Then I did some really bad bench presses and really bad because I could barely use any weight because I don't like to use much weight if I'm by myself because I know that I'm just gonna end up uh, dying. And yeah, I had no one to support me. How, how sad, very sad. Then for a finisher, I just threw in some tricep dips. And yes, my bench is very wobbly, like very, very wobbly. And then once you think we're already done, oh, no, we're not, because I decided to do 10 minutes of burpees as well. Okay, so I'm done with my workout and I have changed my fit and it matches my bike. So I'm gonna go on a bike ride. Oh, 
Okay, so I just went out on a bike ride. It's probably one of my favorite things to do. Very chilled and therapeutic. The only thing I need to really look out for is to not get run over by a car. But you know, if I do, then win-win situation. I actually did nearly get run over talking about that. Um, because I was on the side of the street. I was minding my own business right on the side as much as I could pull over without being on the grass. And then one of the cars decides, yeah, why not? let's just push her off and nearly go into her why not so that was fun nearly died and then actually not as bad as last year last year um once i was out for like an hour by myself just going around in circles and then i nearly got run over twice and then also there was this man and he was like one he insulted the way i pedal because i was in my flip flops and i was like leave me alone but then he also said i have nice feet so you know that was an experience glad that i didn't have that this time around though anyways i am back now after that 30 minutes it was very nice just me just me and my um depression and depressing thoughts anyways now i'm gonna attempt to sunbathe and it's probably gonna last me five minutes because i'm gonna get attacked by wasps or i just i hate heat also, you know what? Staying white is fine. Why do, why do I want to get skin cancer? I don't. This burns. Oh my god. This is pure torture. Why would anyone do this? This is pain. Okay, so that was definitely a lie. Instead of lasting for five minutes i lasted for like 20 seconds that's what he said ha! funny but i am still feeling sweaty and no i have not had a shower um i brushed my teeth though at least like two days ago Okay, so my plans next are the following. I'm gonna go and do my face so that I look presentable and then I need to take pictures for Instagram. Okay, so I have finished my face and got dressed and now my plan is to take a picture. Not any picture, but I really want a new selfie to be my profile picture everywhere because I'm really tired of what I have now. So I'm gonna try and not look ugly.